27th March 2016, a day that began as a happy, joyous Easter morning in Lahore. No one could have imagined what a nightmare that day would have ended in. When a terrorist organization carried out suicide a suicide blast at a children's park in Lahore, leaving over 70 people dead and hundreds injured. I, for one, will never ever be able to forget the horrors of that dreadful day. When I visited the hospital and, the, and witnessed the scenes at the hospital in the aftermath of the bomb, of the bomb attack, it was absolutely horrific. There were children, women, families um, injured so brutally and, and family, children that did not know where their parents were, parents did not know where their children were, families did not know who they had lost and who they had not lost. The horrors were absolutely beyond comprehension. And five years on, the pain still lingers. Families have moved on, but the pain lingers on because souls were scarred that day in the hall. And despite the fact that people have learned to live with the pain and moved on, the horror still haunts them. Life will never ever be the same for all those who were, whose lives were affected in Gulshan Iqbal Park, Lahore on 27th March 2016. Today, five years on, people have moved on, lives have moved forward, people have learned to live, again, people have learned to live with the pain. But the question still arises, has justice been served? The government of Pakistan, unfortunately, has once again failed to provide justice. Lives can be lost, homes can be shattered, children can be traumatized, but no one is held accountable. And, and, and elements such as these are allowed to operate with impunity. The organization that carried out these blasts admitted later on that, it was, that the aim was to target the Christian community on Easter Sunday. However, we continue to ask of the government, we continue to demand for justice. The families still hope that justice will be done. The, despite the fact that our community in Pakistan is a hurting community, we hurt, yes, but our hurt gives us strength and gives us resolve and gives us hope to stand firm in the face of adversity and the face of evil.